We know that things can speed up. And we know that things can slow down. Acceleration is a measure of how quickly things speed up or slow down. We saw in our last episode that when you run a race, your speed starts at zero and then it increases until you reach your maximum speed. We can actually quantify how quickly an object's velocity changes with some fairly simple mathematics. So let's begin. Acceleration is the rate of change of velocity, or in other words, how much an object changes its velocity per second. The formula for calculating acceleration is fairly simple. Acceleration equals the change in velocity divided by the time taken. A equals delta V divided by T. The triangle is actually the Greek letter delta. It's the symbol used in mathematics to indicate the change in a quantity. So let's do an example. If a car accelerates from 50 km per hour to 90 km per hour in 5 seconds, calculate its acceleration. Well, the final velocity equals 90 km per hour, the initial velocity was 50 km per hour, and the time it took was 5 seconds. The change in velocity, delta V, equals 90 km per hour minus 50 km per hour, which equals 40 km per hour. So the acceleration of the car, which is the change in velocity per second, is 40 km per hour divided by 5 seconds, which equals 8. 8 what though? What is the unit for acceleration? Well, in this case, the car has changed on average its speed by 8 km per hour every second. So its acceleration is 8 km per hour per second. It may seem a bit of a strange unit, but mathematically it makes perfect sense. The car changed its velocity by 8 km per hour per second. We can draw up a little table. At the start, the car was travelling at 50 km per hour. After accelerating for one second, it was travelling at 58 km per hour. After two seconds, it was travelling at 66 km per hour. Thanks for watching this short excerpt from Shedding Light on Motion Episode 2 Acceleration. In this episode of the brilliant Shedding Light on Motion series, students are introduced to the concept that acceleration is a measure of how quickly something changes its speed. We look at the mathematics of acceleration and discuss the two main factors that affect the acceleration of falling objects. We explain how animators and special effects crews use their knowledge of the physics of acceleration to create visual effects. And finish by taking a look at the concept of G's. The student worksheets and practical activities that accompany the Shedding Light on Motion series can be downloaded for free from our website at www.liacuseducationalmedia.com. Thanks for watching.